Hey YouTube, how you doing? Thanks for stopping by. It's Carol's react. Carol reacts, and uh, we just been waiting for you because we've got an awful lot of music. We got over twenty one hundred videos, and it's good music. We pretty much specialize between like the fifties to the nineties, but we take some right outside a little newer than that. But I'm taking music that was music, that wasn't computerized or... They did start with some synthesizers, using synthesizers in it, but as far as auto-tune or pitch correct, no, it wasn't that. So, I see these kids with the channels now, and they say, uh, play, play me so-and-so from the Bee Gees. I say, who's the Bee Gees? Well, they know now. And that we had such good music. I don't know where it's gone. But uh, come on by and search my library. <laughs> it's becoming a library. Uh, go on in and stay the day. If you enjoy it, please hit the subscribe and the like and post notification bell will let you know, will notify you whenever I drop a video and Comments and requests are, please. Okay, I'm going to let you go now because we got a request coming up. I have a request for George Harrison and my sweet Lord.
Okay, that was George Harrison's My Sweet Lord. And it's a spiritual journey and his desire for a deeper connection with the divine. This was released in 70 and it was Harrison's first solo single after the breakup of the Beatles. And it became a huge hit worldwide. Uh, the song blends both Christian and Hindu traditions and phrases. And he, he tr tries to bring a message of unity and universal spirituality. Harrison tr tries to uh, bridge the gap between the different religions and promote the harmony among them, the things that, well, it's the things that are alike in, in the uh, different religions. There's an awful lot that's alike, that's the same in, in religions, <coughs> but there are some significant differences. Um, They express that they want to know how I can be closer to a higher power. And this song was in a copyright infringement lawsuit. Harrison was found to have subconsciously plagiarized the melody for the song He's So Fine by the Chiffons. Uh, I don't know what happened, but the song's still out there. The chiffons should be getting paid some money. Uh, uh, this is a good song. I mean, you know, how could it not be? And, and George has got a, got a nice voice. It's something that you didn't hear when he was with the Beatles. Uh, it's kind of a calming and the music is 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 really is really good and uh that's what I can say. The song is just really good. <coughs> uh, okay, well, let me uh, go on and uh, post this. Bye, y'all.